G'day everyone, Viv here. Hope you're all keeping well. Welcome back. Beautiful sunny day here in Melbourne. It's 19, 20 degrees. Spring. Gotta love it in Melbourne. It's so beautiful. Anyway, working on the next set, which I might show you a small preview of. Um, but uh, I needed some more yellow foam or some more extruded uh, polystyrene, but in some thicker uh, pieces than, um, than what I've got here. Sort of, I needed something that was sort of around this thickness. Now this is two pieces jammed together but I didn't want to have to worry about filling a seam line for uh, uh, what I'm doing. So, jumped onto uh, Facebook, uh, chatting with people, doing something different. I wasn't on Facebook looking for uh, extruded polystyrene. But anyway, came across a, a group there where someone had mentioned you can get extruded polystyrene from Bunnings. I've never found it there before. Bunnings, for those people who aren't Australian, is our, one of our big home improvement stores. And uh, anyway, so th they said, look, you can get it there. You've got to uh, look in the... Uh, trade section in the in the timber and lumber yard section out the back went there found it so I thought look let's get a little video I'll show uh, the product show you the label so you can go and find it and uh, see if it performs like the other yellow foam that I'm familiar working with so let's have a look so this is the product here NAF insulation multi-use foam board uh, it comes in two sizes uh, 50 mil and 30 mil both of the sheets are 1200 by 600 this was 20 bucks per sheet the 30 mil is uh, 12 bucks per sheet so this has a weird skin on, on both sides, top and bottom. It has a, a, a different skin than uh, what I believe is on the inside. So I thought, look, let's do a couple of things. We'll see how it cuts with a knife, see how it cuts with a hot, water, uh, hot wire cutter, how it takes impressions and all that sort of stuff. So let's see if we can cut a little piece off of this. It does cut very smoothly. Oh, wow bloody sticker okay so this is much more dense than actually that's that's quite soft on the inside it looks more dense than the other yellow foam that I've got and uh, I'll get some out without a side-by-side -side comparison but um that it cuts very nicely you can see this side where I've snapped it this side where it's got the the knife has gone through let's uh, push a rock into this and see what we get so I got one of my little texturing rocks so we'll Put some uh, texture into this and see what we get. It seems to take an impression okay, as, as you would expect. That's okay. Looks okay. We'll, we'll try a proper piece of scenery from it later on. But it uh, takes a, a texture okay, I'm going to put it in through a hot wire cutter. Here's the hot wire cutter, let's see how this uh, runs through it. It seems to be behaving the same as the other yellow foam that I have. I don't know what the brand of that one is. Turn that off. Okay, so here we go. There's a little bit of hair that's formed on here, but that stuff sort of just rubs off. Sorry if that sounds bad if you're wearing a headset. But uh, that's nice and clean and smooth. It still has a nice skin on it, which the, the heat forms. It's good. I wonder what it's like if we snap a piece. There we go. There's our texture when we snap it. It's not bad. It is expensive, 20 bucks for a, for a sheet of it, but that's still cheaper than if you buy the big sheets. We can't get the big 8 foot by 4 foot sheets and all that sort of stuff. I want to I wanna put a rock onto this skin here, because like I said, it's got a skin. Uh, certainly on this side it has that weird skin. Okay, you can hear that cracking. Okay, so the skin is not good. I guess it might be okay for some things, I guess it depends on what you want. The underside doesn't seem to have the same level of skin. Uh, anyway, so there's the underside, seems to be okay. There's the uh, side with the skin on it. So I don't know if I'd want to use the skin side for doing too much, I'd rather use the side that's a little bit uh, softer rather than this, this harder skin that's on there. Righto, there we go. There's a very quick look at 
review of this uh, yellow foam that you can get from Bunnings. This NAF, NAF insulation multi-use foam board. Hobbies, train, car set bases, arts and craft, floating pool table. Good for insulation as manholes, kennels, filling voids, waterproofing, subterranean waterproofing. So if you're after expanded extruded polystyrene, you might be able to find it at your local Bunnings. It'll be in the big uh, drive through area where all the lumber and timber is, ke is kept. Uh, go and have a look for it. Um, when I asked, they didn't know what it was and don't ask for XPS or uh, polystyrene, they don't know what it is. Uh, tell them that you're looking for the NAF insulation multi-use foam board boards and someone might be able to help you. Hope that's been useful. I'll catch you guys soon. See ya.